Hello guys, Wizard here bringing you another Total War Warhammer replay with commentary. For today's battle, we have the forces of Dawi, and we're going against the uh, Foul Druchi here. And yeah, this is a this is a fun battle, uh, especially when you play as Dark Elves. But um, overall, uh, I like to play dwarfs. I um, especially these matchups that is kind of. Um, d uh, enemy favorite i mean my f enemy's faction favorite so yeah i just wanted to try out some stuff and uh i think this is a this is a good battle so uh let's just jump into the army composition for my front line four units of miners one of them the aircraft miners uh, regiment of renown uh, we also have three units of thunders in the secondary line and uh for the back line we have dwarf warriors when these guys uh, shoot and my opponent breaks through my uh, through my miners uh, these uh, dwarf warriors are supposed to stop them so four dwarf warriors with great weapon one the regular kind i also brought some slayers as well because if your opponent br uh, brings shades uh, you need something to chase them around the map otherwise you're just gonna uh, get destroyed it's just gonna move back and uh, turn around and shoot and you're never gonna catch them so I, th I think this is a good uh, good army here. Uh, I also brought two master engineers, uh, smoke bomb. Um, both of them have uh, fire ring of Thori and restock. Is it restock? Um, let's see. Yeah, restock and uh, Thorik as my uh, army's general. We have a rune of wrath and ruin, and the other one that gives speed and melee attack. Rune of speed. And yeah, that's it for my army. For my opponent, uh, front line of Dread Spears, uh, the second in light, we, we have uh, four units of Dark Shards, we have two units of Hargeneth Executioners, the Ancestors of Slaughter, um, and here we have Crone Helebron and K Knight Assassin with uh, Sorcerer of Shadow. Interesting enough, I usually bring the Beast uh, with Pita of Shades and uh, Withering. The withering uh, so uh, yeah it's a thematic battle the <laughs> uh, cult of cain coming from my four dwarves um i'm not sure if i talked about these harpies as well which is uh, which is a unit that you usually bring as dwarf because they might bring some uh, gyrocopters and yeah you're gonna have a really bad time if you can't fight them so let's start a battle i haven't seen my opponent's army here uh, yet i've seen some Units on the uh, flanks, I think. I'm, I'm seeing these dark, uh, dark shards and bleak swords, but uh, it doesn't matter. Uh, the uh, the how how this battle goes is pretty uh, um, straightforward. You have to use your uh, miners with blasting charges on the bleak swords, and then try to gun down e any um, anti-infantry units like these Hargan executioners and. Uh, sisters of singing doom which helps uh, they're they do really good against um, characters as well so um, my opponent um, I'm not sure what what is uh, what is he doing he's trying to I think probably uh, dodge the blasting charges uh, he's moving a lot of his uh, bleak swords um, to the flanks and now he moves the other one that was a really nice move there i was trying to go and uh, use my blasting charges on the on these dark shots because they don't have they don't have any more defense but uh yeah my opponent wisely uh, stopped one of them but the other one uh, gets through and that blasting charges just destroyed that unit of dark shot which is uh which is not what you want to see so engineers with their 180 uh, range are um, shooting Hellebron. Uh, Torex uh, got excited a bit, <laughs> moved in, and that that could have been a disaster there if Crone uh, just could uh, attack him for a few more few more seconds. Um, the reason I don't bring the, um, the oh my God, what's the name of the thing? The Anvil of Doom is because uh, Dark Shards usually, usually just focus it down and destroy it. I played another game uh, that I did uh, bring it and just Torek just got destroyed, which is uh, which is really bad um, if, if you want to win. So uh, Harp is coming down, trying to 
disrupt the thunders but i have these layers uh backing them up i'm gonna send the uh, these units to deal with this one as well murderous prowess proct uh which is uh which is a, a scary sight to see these hargenet executioners are gonna beat any infantry i have uh easily so have to uh have to be careful about that have to um uh, move back and shoot units here uh, these uh, sisters of singing doom trying to go for my um range unit thunders here i use a smoke bomb here and a ring of tory charge so uh, they take a lot of damage and these um thunders have already shot them to beats uh these hargan and execution are trying to get close but they're getting shot at by these uh thunders as well uh, i moved them back um not in the nick of time but um i think i saved them a lot of uh trouble here i use the uh, another smoke bomb uh, trying to shoot these uh, Harganeth uh, executioners model down before they can do uh, my um, thunders here. Sorek unfortunately fought these uh, Harganeth executioners and uh, yeah, uh, the results are apparent. He took a lot of damage there. I think I used the uh, um, um, Rune of Wrath and Ruin when these guys were bunched up. So that probably did a uh, good enough uh, damage here. These thunders shooting at these executioners, uh, these dwarf warriors uh, trying to stop these harpies from ca uh, causing trouble for my um, uh, thunders here. We dealt with the other Harganeth executioners, we shut them down uh, with Master Engineer and thunders and even slayers. We were able to get a decent rear charge, so I'm happy about that. The Sorcerer of Shadow getting shot down uh, by these um, Master Engineer. Uh, yeah, master engineers here. Uh, some of my slayers got into back lines, which means uh, yeah, my opponent uh, is not gonna have a <laughs> dec uh, decent uh, backline protection from for his uh, dark shots. So yeah, um, I think Bands of Power just moved into my favor. But uh, yeah, this matchup used to be really hard for dwarfs, but with the um, newer additions to dwarfs like Thoric and ma uh, master engineers. Uh, you can do a lot here. The, in the other matchup, uh, in the other match, I lost, and that was because um, I uh, brought Torek on his um, Anvil of Doom, and uh, he got shot down. You want him in the melee uh, because, yeah, he does decent there. Uh, he got shot down by die shards and got uh, shot to pieces, unfortunately. And uh, my opponent has brought in Hydra as well. Um, and I shot it a lot. I used um, two giant slayers that I brought. Uh, but um, yeah, he came back at the end of the battle. He regent, and uh, yeah, I had no ways to uh, defeat uh, my opponent army. It was really similar to this. Uh, he didn't have uh, sisters of Singing Doom. Uh, he had two witch elves. Uh, the uh, bleak swords were similar. Uh, Morathi was there as well. I was able to snipe her as well with these master engineers. Uh, but yeah. Um, the other battle I didn't play well and I forgot to uh, save the replay unfortunately. It was, a, it was a good battle as well. So I hope you guys enjoyed this battle. If you did, uh, I would really appreciate it if you guys consider leaving a like and subscribing. It would really help me and my channel grow. Uh, I upload videos daily, so stay tuned for that as well. I also have a Discord server. <clears throat> if you guys want to chat, hang out, send me bills, send me replays to cast, you can find the link in the description of this video. So that's it. Uh, catch you all later. Bye.